welcome to my i don't know i did that welcome to my fashion channel you guys a while ago i posted on my instagram a poll of what i should do with this channel because i wanted to do something with it and i'm like kind of rebranding i just changed my other channel to paranormal pi and i'm just strictly doing paranormal on there and i wanted to have a little fun with this channel so i did a poll and fashion videos one so this is going to be my fashion channel. I'm going to be honest, I didn't think that was going to win, so I wasn't prepared. So it took me a while to get to this point of knowing what to film. I will be showing you guys all of my costumes, like the actual costumey costumes I have on my Instagram and TikTok. Um, the like 31 costumes for Halloween in October and I have a bunch of like stuff that I can make into costumes uh, I won't be doing those I will just be doing the actual costumey costumes <laughs> if that makes sense because getting into these costumes for one video is going to take a lot of energy <laughs> and I can only do so much so let's just get into it I have a whole bin <laughs> I also hope that this video kind of lets you get to know me really well. Um, I have like costumes based on, you know, the fandoms I like. A lot of Disney, I will say that. I have a lot of Disney and I love that because I do love Disney. But I want to, I want my first fashion video on here to be something that you can really get to know me for just to kind of know what to expect for other videos i kind of want to keep like this dark theme <laughs> i'm not explaining it very well because like my other channel is paranormal pi so i do paranormal and dark stuff on there all the time and i kind of want this channel to kind of match that vibe just in a more fashiony way just to stick to like my niche although this will probably be my mostly like fun cutesy video because i do have some costumes that are fun and cutesy <laughs> Anyways, first we're going to start off with this dress. It is, whoa, there's a lot of things going on. I'm going to show you, just so you know what it is, and then I'll tell you. Yeah, this fashion needs to be around. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's Megara from Hercules. What's yeah. going on? This is Megara. I, this is actually one of my favorites. And I had this is like one of my more recent ones that I got in, and ugh, I'm in love with it, especially when I have a ponytail. Yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite costumes. I have only worn this over social media, and I'm looking, waiting for the perfect moment to wear this out in public because I love it. People need to see it. Next one is Cher. From Clueless, this is like a one piece. Yeah, let's get into this one. Okay. This one, let me put it back. See the, the uh, socks. Okay, yeah, words. Okay. This one, it's like I love it, but at the same time, I kind of hate it because it, it, it does look cheap. <laughs> but I mean, I love the look with the socks. I think it's it's cute and it works for pictures and stuff but it's not the best functional wise <laughs> so but yeah this is <laughs> this is it okay next one the top probably already guess what it is But let's go. As you can tell, this is one of my more risque costumes. Um, but I mean, have you seen Jasmine? Anyways, yes, this is Jasmine from Aladdin. <laughs> Anyways, this costume is kind of hard to put on, especially with like these side beams. And it doesn't fit exactly right on me. 
so it's like I feel yeah <laughs> but it's kind of fun it is very itchy honestly to be honest so this one's not really one of my favorites to put on <laughs> but There it is. <laughs> Next one is probably like my favorite one out of all of these. If I can just get some things right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. It's a Cleopatra costume. And no, it is not historically accurate. And yeah, that kind of does bug me. But I do love this dress and I love it on me. And I kind of made some adjustments to make it a little more accurate and better, I guess. <laughs> There's not much to go off of, but this is what we got. Um, the costume came with these kind of down at the sides, like just like this is. Um, but I sewed them up. And then I made these made slits just like this <laughs> um, in the skirt higher. Let's go. So this is the Cleopatra one. I wanted to like have this be kind of like look like it's coming down in front because that's kind of more true to fashion back then. But this kind of gets in the way. I don't know. It works. It's. I guess it works fine. Yes. And like there's like velvet on the top which does bug me makes it look really cheap I like that but it is fun to wear just as the dress itself like these sleeves I love them I love them so yes <laughs> you can already guess what this is just look at that you know what it is okay it's Barbie. Yes, this is what this costume is. It's Barbie and these have pockets. And I know this in the movie, she does not have pockets back there. So, ha. Anyways, you got the, yeah. So the top is like big on me. I can't remember what size I got this in. I think it was medium. I don't know. Or a large. I don't, I don't not know. Anyways, the pants fit me like perfect, but the top is a little big. And I think I wore this for Halloween last year. And I think then I had I kind of had it safety pinned, but I didn't want to keep it in there. I wish this had front pockets though. Anyways, oh, I also have the hat. Let me get the hat. My hair is in a ponytail, so it's kind of hard to put on. Anyways, hat. Yeah. Anyways, I this is definitely one of my favorite costumes. It is very flexible. I just wish that the top was tighter. But it is definitely one of my favorites. I want to wear it every day. I love the I love the pants. This is probably the most girliest costume I have. And it is one of my favorites. But, you know, it's Barbie, so I had to. Okay. This one, I will say, definitely looks cheap. But, I love the way it looks on me. <laughs> I do have the veil. Oh, the ponytail, my goodness. Okay. Veil. Woo. This one was one of my favorite ones to do for like the uh, 31 Halloween costumes in October because like the makeup was wonderful. I love that makeup. It was great. And with the dress, I just loved it. I love this dress on me. Okay. 
this is my last one for this video. I could probably show you more. The other ones I have, I am still looking for more pieces. I don't have like a full thing. <laughs> so I want to wait till I have a full thing to show you guys those. But this is not an exact dress replica, but to be honest, I don't really like that dress. <laughs> But I like this one. I think it's so cute. There's Sally from Night Before Christmas. I really just like this one. It's kind of got like uh, an 80s vibe to it and I love it. Um, these and the tights um, I got like years ago <laughs> and I never had the dress until like this just this past year. So and now I have a full thing and they're kind of small a little bit I can get them on but it's a difficult but yeah here's Sally also I lied this is not the last one I have one more <laughs> Miss Daphne let's go okay don't mind it with my other stuff and my little necklaces and stuff and my hair whatever but anyways this is my Daphne costume the sleeves are kind of ugh the costume is all right and I think all together it looks good but as itself it's kind of an ugly looking dress <laughs> but it's also more true to like the classic Daphne and I kind of like that so <laughs> yeah this is the last one I will I can show you the other ones other times when I like finish them also if you have any um, fashion video ideas comment them below I do have a couple written down but your guys's help would be very much appreciated i hope you enjoyed this video let me know which one was your favorite yeah i love you guys remember to follow your dreams i'll use the outro on this channel remember to follow your dreams bye